Hi, I'm Macy Griffith, and today's scripture comes from the Gospel of John, chapter 18, verses 28 through 40. Then they took Jesus from Caiaphas to Pilate's headquarters. It was early in the morning. They themselves did not enter the headquarters, so as to avoid ritual defilement and to be able to eat the Passover. So Pilate went out to them and said, What accusation do you bring against this man? They answered, If this man were not a criminal, we would not have handed him over to you. Pilate said to them, Take him yourselves and judge him according to your law. The Jews replied, We are not permitted to put anyone to death. This was to fulfill what Jesus had said when he indicated the, king, the kind of death he was to die. Then Pilate entered the headquarters again, summoned Jesus, and asked him, Are you the king of the Jews? Jesus answered, Do you ask this on your own, or did others tell you about me? Pilate replied, I am not a Jew, am I? Your own nation and the chef priests have handed you over to me. What have you done? Jesus answered, My kingdom is not from this world. If my kingdom were from this world, my followers would be fighting to keep me from being handed over to the Jews. But as, to, but as it is, my kingdom is not from here. Pilate asked him, So you are a king? Jesus answered, You say that I am a king. For this I am born, and for this I, am, I came into the world to testify to the truth. Everyone who belongs to the truth listens to my voice. Pilate asked him, What is the truth? After he had said this, he went out to the Jews again and told them, I find no case against him, but you have a custom that I release someone from you at the Passover. Do you want me to release for you the king of the Jews? They shouted in a reply, Not this man, but, Barab but Barbados, now Barab Barabbas, was abandoned. Let us pray. Lord, what you ask of my life seems so right. It is how I want to live, following your son, Jesus, so closely. And yet I fail so often to stay on that path. I cannot do it alone, loving Lord. I need your help and guidance. I need to remember your love for me, and I want to remember how very much I need you in my life. Amen.